Someone or some group is calling people in Luzerne County and beyond, claiming they owe money to the county, saying that they have to pay up or face arrest. Our lead eye team reporter Andy Mahalshik is at the Luzerne County Courthouse live tonight with more on what this one's all about. Andy. Hey Nick, this scam has Luzerne County officials very concerned indeed because the callers sound like the real deal. Plus, those receiving the calls may be duped in part because the number showing up on their phone's caller ID makes it appear at least that those calls are coming from this courthouse. Law enforcement has been inundated with calls from people from not just Luzerne County, but throughout Pennsylvania and the nation. Those scammers claim to be from one of the many county offices located inside the courthouse, including the district attorney's office and the sheriff's department. In one scam call, the Karn artist told the person that she owed money for an outstanding fine that if she did not pay up immediately, she'd be arrested. It is very brazen when they are willing to take a number from a government agency from Luzerne County um, and use it in order to scam people. It's called spoofing and is very easy to do. There's numerous applications out there that are it's literally we call it spoofing. But spoofing is in, in simple terms is it allows someone to use a fake caller ID other than their own phone number to make it look like it's a legit call. Luzerne County Detective Chaz Ballow spoofed a call to me. Call the Luzerne County, make it look like it's coming from the Luzerne County Courthouse. When in reality it's not, it's coming right from my own phone. Okay, that number, 825-1500, is the Luzerne County Courthouse. That's correct. And in reality it's actually coming from my phone. Detective Ballo offered up these tips. If you receive a call like this, hang up and call the real office in question. Don't engage the person calling. Report the call to law enforcement. We will not be calling you um, if you are out on a KBS. We're not going to be calling you saying that you need to come in. And D.A. Salaventus admits and says, quite frankly, catching these scammers or arresting them is virtually impossible because in most cases they operate out of the country. Reporting at the Luzerne County Courthouse in Wilkesboro, Andy Mahal, Chicago Witness News. Nick? All right, Andy, thank you. Scams like this one are not isolated to Luzerne County. Similar scams have been reported throughout the region. You might need an umbrella.